All right, what's up, everybody? Uh, this is Jason here from KingsEliteBreaks.com. We are doing a 2016 Panini Contenders Draft Picks Football two by two, two box break, two random teams, uh, number two. So, um, yeah, Contenders, man, it's a good product. Uh, at the end of the break as well, uh, we are gonna uh, give away this nice little Hunter Henry uh, rookie patch autograph out of NT to one customer in the break. So I'm gonna randomize these lists of names that are in the break. Person that comes out number one gets that uh, gets that nice little card right there. So let's uh, roll the dice. Uh, we got a five and a six, so a five and a one. Sorry, so that's six times on the list of the names and the teams in this break. So thank you to everybody that's in this break, from Nathan to King D, Last Bomb Mojo to Christian to Colin and Freddie. All right, so there we go. That was uh, six times. Good luck. One, two, three. Four, five, and six. Nice. All right, after six times, we got King D. You're at number one. And Nathan, you're at 32 spot. All right, so there's that. Let's go six times now on the list of teams. Oh, I copied actually baseball. Hold up a second, guys. What's going on there? Let me copy that. Oh, I actually went all the way down to baseball. That's what happened. All right, so let's copy this really quick and put in the football. So there we go. That should be 32. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, and six. I know I, I copied <laughs> it. Copied the football list and the ba baseball list right after the other. I had baseball at the bottom, so I, I'm glad I caught that. <laughs> All right, so Seahawks at the number one spot. And then you have the Tennessee Titans at the bottom. You know, like I said, I'm, I'm still a little rusty, man. I, it's been a while. It's been a couple months. So, get a little break. All right, so King D, man. You have the Seattle Seahawks. Actually, let me just uh, scroll, make this a little bit bigger so everybody can see. All right, so King D, you got the uh, Seahawks, Nathan with the Raiders. King D with the Jaguars and Chiefs. Nathan with the Packers. Colin, you have the Bears. Freddie with the Bengals. King D, you have the Houston Texans. Uh, Christian with the Bucks. Colin with the Browns. King D, last ball mojo with the Giants and Panthers. Nathan, you got the Broncos, Cowboys, Bills, Saints, Rams, and Steelers. Um, King D, you got the Falcons. Freddie with the Baltimore Ravens. Nathan with the Patriots and Cardinals. King D, last ball mojo with the Redskins. Nathan, you have the Jets, Dolphins, Chargers, Eagles, Lions, Colts. Christian with the Minnesota Vikings, Nathan with the 49ers, and the Tennessee Titans. All right, guys, so let's alphabetize this really quick. There we go. Um, do that. Uh, there's a, there's vets in here, but it's more rookie-driven, but you can get some good vets. I mean, obviously, if you want to check out the checklist for yourself, you can always do that as well. But um, I, I, there's a good amount of vets in here, though. I know there is, for sure. There's a good amount of vets. So I'm pretty sure you can find yourself some nice cowboys, older older players in there too. You just gotta take a look. Alright. So will there be any trades, guys? That is the question. All right, guys, so this is just my little text, so that's for the break. But uh, if there's not going to be any trades, I'll just close it. Let's close it, might as well. Christian saying, anybody want the Bucks or the Vikings? So if anybody wants to try to make a trade. King D, are you willing to trade the uh, Washington Redskins? Nathan saying, uh... If if you would like to make a trade, if not, we can get it going. Uh, let me just open up the 
pro football reference. I'm gonna open up a Wikipedia page. Uh, skins for who, Dallas? Who are you? Who are you willing to give up? So if we're looking at Nathan, uh, Nathan has the Cardinals, Bills, uh, Cowboys, Broncos, Lions, Packers, Colts, Chargers, Rams, Dolphins, Patriots, Saints, Jets, Raiders, Eagles, Steelers. All right, all right. Nathan just said, just we'll just break it then. All right, then. So then we'll just close it. So he just he just said he'll just we'll just break it now. All right, then cool. All right, cool. All right then. So I got that copied. Put this down right here. And uh, let me just quickly update this little break thing. So, like I said, if you're if you're not here, which it should only be like one or two customers, um, you can see who you have right at the bottom of the screen in case you miss it. All right, so there's all these boxes that are right here. Uh, like I said, box one, two, four, five. Uh, that is a seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, 11 and 12 so a lot of boxes are left let's go back then let's generate oops sorry First of all, let's do that. so 12 boxes total available let's generate one and that'll be box three that is not available let's do that again really quick two yes two is available There we go, box two. Put that right there. So this is one box we'll generate for this break. And another box is box one, and one is available. So there we go, box one and two. These boxes will be for future breaks. So I'll move these out of here really quick. All right, guys, thanks for the fill. Like I said, there's five autographs in these boxes. Nice stuff. Hope to pull you guys some nice hits. I get so used to the uh, I get so used to the uh, upper deck. Upper deck actually they, they rip they have their sleeve around so usually this way. Well panini it's the opposite. So I can use a ripper like this to be easier for me. You know what? I have no clue. That's something I have to look into. But if, if I'm assuming if Contenders Hockey had hot boxes, why wouldn't these, right? I mean, maybe that's maybe that's only a regular Contenders. I'd actually have to look into that. That's a good question. What would the hot boxes consist of in hockey? Like extra autographs or more numbered cards or... Oh man, yeah, I don't know if that has that, but that would be pretty crazy. 
that hot boxes would have 18 autographs? That is insane. I don't know. Maybe maybe in um maybe in regular contenders. Not sure. It's a good question though. All right, we'll do this first box first. Good luck, everyone. We got Malcolm Mitchell. And that is a 12 of 15 Malcolm Mitchell. Nice. Low number. Georgia Bulldog. Ah, uh, that makes sense. <laughs> Don't be the, the bad autographs in there. That's a nice low number right there. 12 of 15. Malcolm Mitchell. So let's quickly just look that up. New England Patriots, Malcolm Mitchell. So that'll be going to the Pats. So New England Patriots. Who has the New England Patriots? Nathan. There you go, man. Nice little card right there for you, man. Actually... Grab these backwards. Sorry about that. So you guys can see them really quick. I think I might have forgot this stock too. I, I, he sounds familiar. But, I mean, it's an out of 15, man. So that's pretty short printed right there. Nice Carson Wentz. Brandon Allen. Autograph right there. Arkansas Razorbacks. So just just to speed up the break, we'll look up these uh, of these teams at the end of the break, unless they're pretty obvious. But there's two autographs so far, so there should be another uh, three left in the rest of this box. So we'll go through these cards right here. Go right there. Let's go to the second stock. There's that Eric Stryker. We go right there. Man, I just pulled one of these yesterday. Forgot who he plays for. I think he was on a practice squad last, if I remember. But we'll look that up at the end of the break as well. Guys, so that's three autographs. We have two more in here somewhere. Jordan Payton, college ticket. No, I know he doesn't play anymore. I just got to remember the last team he played for. And I, I pulled one of those yesterday. All right, so there should be one more ink in here somewhere. Here he is. Mackenzie Alexander. Nice one. Four out of 99. So like I said, I'll look these up after the break. Or at the end of the break, sorry. And then we'll announce who these go to to the rifle owners. But that's the first five autographs right there of the first box. It's not a bad box. We got an out of 15 Michael Mitchell and an out of 99 Mackenzie Alexander. So it's not too bad right there. So 
put that right there. Let's open up this box now. Yeah, I mean it has a lot of it has a lot of uh, you know lower end draft pick autographs, but at the same time, I mean you know this this actually draft class is pretty solid. So obviously, it just depends what kind of box you get, though. Obviously, you know. But there's always some really nice autographs you can get out of here. So, I mean, if you, I mean, think about it. I didn't get to rip any of the new contenders 2017, but think about, like, all the, you know, later round running backs, like Alvin Kamara and Kareem Hunt for the Ch uh, Chiefs and stuff like that. Coming out early on when they probably released this type of product for them, you know, they weren't big prospects until the season started. So, it's like, there's some, I think Stephon Diggs is in this draft too, I think, isn't he? Or was that 2015? Oh no, actually, LeCron Treadwell is actually in this one. So Stephon Diggs, 2015. All right, guys, last box right here. Good luck to everybody. We got Jalen Mickens, Washington Husky. Daniel Lasco out of Cal. <laughs> you just want to see the autograph. That's funny. That's a nice one right here. Connor Cook, great quarterback in college. And that is a 35 of 99. If I remember correctly, Connor Cook still Oakland Raiders. So that's three autographs already, guys. Should be two more. Right here we got a uh, Calhoun. I don't think I'm going to try to uh, attempt the first name, although I think it's pretty simple, but Shokwe, Shokwe. We'll look that up, like I said, at the end of the break. All right, guys, there should be one more autograph in here somewhere. Good luck. I think I found it. Daniel Brave uh, Braverman, Western Michigan. There we go.
Like I said, a lot of these inserts actually sell very well. You'd be surprised. Like a couple of these Carson Wentz inserts that I've passed by these game days of like Jared Goff sell for a couple dollars a piece. Which is crazy, to be to be honest. They produce so much of this stuff. Alright guys, so that was the break. Here are the autographs we're going to look at. Make sure that we put these to the right teams. Uh, so let me get my post notes really quick. Get this ready. So the first person we're going to look, look at, I mean, is going to be the Daniel uh, Braverman. So let's check that out. But still not a bad break, though, Nathan. That uh, Connor Cook out of 99 is nice, and that Malcolm Mitchell for out of 15 is not bad at all. So Daniel Braverman. Kansas City Chiefs. So that'll be going to the Chiefs. Who has the Chiefs? KC Chiefs. That's King D. So there you go, King D. Got yourself some ink. Our next guy is the Shakul Calhoun. Oakland Raiders. So that's another hit for the Raiders, and that's another hit for Nathan. All right, Raiders. Yes. It's Raiders. And we got Daniel. That's uh, Moscow. New Orleans Saints. And New Orleans Saints is Nathan. So there you go, man. It's another hit for you right there, Nathan. And it's uh, J. Quan. Or no, J. Don. Uh, that is Jacksonville Jaguars. J. Don, Jacksonville Jaguars. Who has the Jaguars? Uh, King D. So they go King D. That's a hit for you right there. All right, so that's two autos for you, King D. And we're going to look at this. Mackenzie Alexander was actually at a 99. That'll be going to the Minnesota Vikings. Mackenzie Alexander at 99, Minnesota Vikings. Hey, there you go, Christian. First break here with me. First hit right there for you, man. Mackenzie Alexander to 99. Not too shabby right there with the Vikings. Uh, then we got Jordan Payton, which if I remember correctly, that should be, I think, uh, Green Bay Packers. No, Cleveland Browns, actually. So Cleveland Browns with that hit. Call him a toy with the Jordan Payne autograph. Uh, I remember Eric Strike. We had to look him up over here. Buffalo Bills is the last team associated with for Eric Stryker. Buffalo Bills. Nathan, that's for you, man. You get Mr. Stryker. William Stryker's younger son from X Men. <laughs> and the last one is Brandon Allen. who is with the Los Angeles Rams. So that'll be going to Nathan as well with the LA Rams. All right, guys, so that was the break. Sorry, everybody, it being a little longer break with this college stuff. Always want to make sure that I announce who this, who the cards go to. So from now on, I'll just probably just be ripping through the cards, showing you the hits, and at the end of the break, we can announce which teams are going to. But let's just quickly uh, roll the dice really quick. I'm going to randomize the list of names, and a person that comes in on top, will win this nice little Hunter Henry 20 of 99 rookie gear out of NT. All right. So we'll copy this list. Roll it. A oh, two and a one. So three times on the list of names and the teams. Three times. Good luck, guys. One. 
two, and three. After three times, King D. Well, there you go, man. After three times, it was up. You. Oh, man, I deleted it now. Oh, man, I deleted it. But it was you, King D. Damn it. All right, well, I see King D. You're at the top, man. After three times, you're going to get this nice little uh, Hunter, Hunter Henry. So there you go, man. So this is kingsleadbreaks.com. I'll post another uh, contour. I mean, uh, sorry, not contours. Contenders break up in the store. And like I said, we do have that contours break where I will be giving away a nice Artemi Panarin black RPA to somebody in that break as well, which is this little nice card right here. So if you get into contours, you have a chance to win this nice Artemi Panarin out of 15 right here, man. So there you go. Kingsleadbreaks.com. My name is Jason. See you guys next time.